being born and raised in London, having this kind of East Asian heritage, but also growing up in the West, I've always felt like I was bridging these two cultures, these two groups. Am I in one camp or in another camp? And actually, I think it's this idea that Jesus was part of a persecuted minority. So God could enter history in any time, in any place, in any way. And he chooses to enter in the lowliest of ways. And that just reveals so much of the heart of God. If you go back to first century Judaism, I think it's probably more like Chinese culture than um, Western culture. You know, that kind of honor shame dynamic. It is a truly global faith that doesn't matter where you come from, you don't have to minimize your culture and heritage. In fact, it renews it. That's what following Jesus can do. It renews and transforms culture. The more I've read and discovered more of the person of Jesus, I, I realized Jesus was part of a minority group. He deeply understood what it felt like to be oppressed, to be marginalized. And if you read any of the gospels, you will see that Jesus is always on the margins, bringing people outside into God's kingdom. Everyone is welcome. No one is outside his grace and no one is beyond his transformative love and power. And I think that has opened my eyes to see other people, to see all people as image bearers made in the image of God. It's opened my eyes to see things from different perspectives, but also to recognize that the church has always been a place where there's been diversity and unity around the person of Jesus. And that's because God doesn't show any favoritism. He welcomes all in. We all have a unique offering, expression, um, that comes with our worship, that comes with how we see God. And actually together, we reflect the manifold wisdom of God when we're given that kind of freedom to express our love and our worship in, in the way that we're created to do so. Thank you so much for watching. We hope this video has blessed you. Our crowdfunding studio relies on the generosity of our viewers. So if you'd like to help us capture more conversations like the one you've just seen, you can find all of the information on how to give in our bio.